Hey everybody, I want to uh, talk to you real quickly about your course names and section names. A lot of teachers, and I totally understand, are not liking the name of the course and the name of the section that's being pulled over from Infinite Campus. It's not intuitive, and I totally understand that. Unfortunately, we cannot change those. I had to lock everyone away from it so that, um, well, if you did change it, all the enrollments and moving around would cause the district install of Schoology to crumble like pillars of sand and we none of us want that so um, I talked to Schoology about it and they are trying to make these names aliases for everybody in the world that they do they're working on it but for now the answer is no you can't so how can we uh, give an intuitive way for our students to find our courses the right one well my suggestion is to change this picture here from a dull gray book to a descriptive icon and um, you can see there's an edit picture right there. That's where we're going to upload it. But let me show you the process. I did, I did go online. I got a, an uh, algebra clip art. Uh, and what I'm going to do is actually open up Pages. Uh, pages is really easy to use for this purpose. I'm going to create a new document and just, yeah, sure, a blank one. And I'm going to drop this picture that I got from the Internet in there like this. And one of the first things I'm going to do is kind of dull this out little bit out there by using the opacity and again I'm in the style area there next I'm gonna use a text box and I'm gonna write in oh algebra hour one and you can't really see it too well so what I do need to do is make it big there we go and I'm gonna center it and I might want to change the font to what is that hobo hobo stud hobo std um, and I'm gonna change the color of it to I don't know something like this maybe a little bit bigger and drag that up in front probably actually want to even make it bigger cover the whole picture select all there and let's just go big go big or go home right here we go that should do it so I'm gonna resize my text box there we go maybe the background I'm gonna select the background again and get it dull there we go there we go once I'm happy with it I'm gonna use a keyboard command uh, to take a screenshot call that or that using the keys shift command 4 and what it does is, you probably didn't notice that, here's my cursor down here, or here's my mouse, shift command four, all at the same time, it turns it into a crosshair. And then I'm gonna just select there, I'm, I'm grabbing up in the corner, holding down, I'm gonna let go, boom. And it took a picture, and here it is, here's my icon. Right there, good, maybe I wanna do an hour two, so I'm going to switch it to hour two. Again, shi uh, command shift four all at the same time. My uh, uh, cursor goes into a crosshair. I'm going to take a picture of that. And if you go slower, yours will look better than mine. And here's my hour two. And these are what I'm going to upload. Uh, you may want to save this file when you're all done. I'm going to get rid of it because I won't need it. But next thing we need to do is change the name of these files. So I uh, selected the file hit return and now I'm just going to type ALG1 for Al Algebra 1 uh, select the next one hit return ALG2 I'm ready to upload so I'm going to go on over here to my um, course let's pretend that Mr. Marshanda test section 1 is uh, my Algebra 1 class so I'm going to hover over the book click on edit picture and then now I'm going to attach a file I'm going to get my LG1 picture and put it right there. And now we have an icon that will help students and will help me find my hour one algebra. Uh, if I look in courses here, you can see that it's changed up there too on iPads and in Chromebooks. It'll all change right away. So that is how you can uh, make your course a little bit more identifiable until Schoology fixes their whole uh, the situation with... Um, the actual course names being out there. Um, when those become aliases, 
then maybe we can change them. But until that time, this is my suggestion. Hope that helps. Feel free to always shoot me an email.